So another question that we often get about eagles in particular is that they're so large. Do people have to worry about their small pets in their backyard? In Minnesota, we have a lot of eagles, especially in the urban area, so I can see where that question would come from. Well, we have to look at this a couple different ways. And one of the ways that we have to look at it is what eagles, and bald eagles in particular, want to eat. Bald eagles are fish eaters and they're scavengers. So they are eating uh, fish coming, from, coming to the surface of the water. They're also finding animals that are already dead, including fish, that they eat. So that is kind of what their search image is when they are looking for food. They will eat other things occasionally, like injured waterfowl and those kinds of things, but the majority of their food is the, the fish and the dead, dead animals. So when it comes to the small dog that you have in your backyard, not really on their search image. It's not really what they're searching for. That's the first thing. So that doesn't eliminate the possibility, but it really reduces it. The other thing that you need to know is that Paul Beagles, where they look so huge, so, the bald eagles we have in Minnesota can range anywhere from 8 pounds to maybe 13 pounds in weight. The, the females being the larger, the males being the smaller. This bald eagle that's behind me is weighing in about the size of a gallon of milk, about 8 pounds. It's really not that much. We often say that, that they can catch and carry about a quarter of their weight. Now, they can kill something a little bit bigger than that, but it's going to be harder and harder and harder for them to carry it away. Why carrying it away is important is because for safety of the bird. The bird wants to catch something, take it up into a tree, and eat it in the safety of the tree. So those few things kind of help tell you whether or not it's likely that, that a bird like this would go after something that um, like a small dog or anything like that. So there are other challenges that for our small pets that are left alone or unattended in our backyard that you need to be aware of. So certainly uh, people are concerned about the aerial predators like bald eagles when they come to the raptor center, but people need to think about other dogs, um, cats, people, coyotes that might be in the area. So there's other types of challenges that our small pets may have to face. So our suggestion is when you bring your pet outside, especially a small pet, you should be with it and you should be attending it at all times because we are a lot bigger and that will deter any other challenges that are out there.